right, so today we're talking about one night stands. I'm not doing a history of it because y'all know what one night stands are. Y'all know what sex on the first date is. So that's either here nor there. This is really, this is really just an opinion show today. Hey, I got a bunch of opinions, we love and opinions. none of them are a fact. All right. That's what an opinion is. No, you got an opinion that's fact though. What the fuck? No, no your opinion is what you formulate in your I head. Completely. I think it's water is wet. This is gonna be a good episode. That's no, that's not a fact because this is gonna be a good episode. My opinion. Let's talk about sex, baby. Let's talk about you and me. Let's talk about all the good things and the bad things that may be. Let's talk about sex. Let's talk about sex. Let's talk about sex. Let's talk. Ashley Neal. I'm Trey Perilla. And I'm Elijah Colas. And this is the Birds, Birds and, and the Bees. A sex talk show where we not only just talk about sex, but we get into it. Like we talk about the things that y'all don't really ever really talk about. You know, we know about penises and vaginas, but what do we know about the mind? What do we know about the spirit, the emotion of sex? So let's get into it. One night stands versus sex on a first date. What is a one night stand? What do you guys consider a one night stand? Because I know a lot of people don't think of a one night stand as the same thing. The thing that I put my juice on, like by my bed. Oh, so a uh, one night stand. Yes. Got it. But a one night stand. All right. I'm gonna put crickets. I'm gonna order corn. I'm putting crickets after that one. Because you made me put crickets after mine. I'm putting crickets after that one. Nah, I didn't order corn with my meal. I'm sorry. Ooh! But did you order some cheese? Because it's cheesy. Oh, lactose intolerant. There's another cricket. Another cricket. Okay, when I stand, a lot of people really don't know what it is. Like, when I stand, a lot of people really don't know the actual technical term of a one night stand. Like. Do you guys think it it has to be with a stranger or it could be with someone you know? No, um, I think stranger. I like, thought it was like it was one person, it, you just never do it again. Yeah. No. I interpret it as a stranger. Like the definition that I looked up on UrbanDictionary.com. Stranger, like it says stranger. It's like stranger. it's like you go to a club, you see them like, oh shoot, you look good. I wanna you. Yeah. And then y'all hook up. What clubs are you going to? That I'm not. I, this, is, I'm, this is just. Yo, Trey, what's good, bro? I what's wanna up? you, man. Me too. Oh yeah. Uh, we're gonna leave. It's only eight thirty. I just got here. Forget these drinks. <laughs> I'm trying to get a Fendom draw. You mean it's not that easy? No. <laughs> I always thought it was that easy. Women have that thing called self-respect. That is not, not like that. <laughs> self-respect in a good way. Keep it. I didn't really mean like that in a bad I don't even know what Alright, how about mean. this? How about this? You just made mm -hmm. yourself stop. Alright. <laughs> so, the biggest question, for me at least, is what is most acceptable in your eyes? Do you think a one night stand is more acceptable or sex on the first date? One night stand. I, yeah, sex I, on the first date. I say one, one night stand. One night stand? Are you serious? No, they're no, not. They're okay, wait, wait, wait. Okay, 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 no, here's, here's why for a one night stand. Of, I'm not seeing okay. you. Like I just met you, then it's not a date. Wait, but date, like for me, for it. sex on the first date could just end up being a one night stand. Like if I'm on a yeah, date with the first one, then okay, I want to keep seeing the them, so I'm not just gonna do that. A one night stand. We're gonna we're gonna define both. We're gonna define both. So. One night stand, we're going to define it and we can all collectively mutually like come up with a definition. One night stand, you have sex, let's not say stranger, you have sex with a person and then after that sexual encounter, you don't talk to them or have sex with okay. them again. Can I add something? Is it premeditated? Because I thought that's no. what it is. You don't go out with the intention of meeting yes, someone. No, no, no. no. A one that's night stand saying. is, you're, it's not planned. Like, I don't know. A one night there are stand people is, that do go out to just... Like, they go out to a bar or a club that night just because yes, they want to find somebody. But, but it was, like, random. Like, yeah. you could went home yeah. with nobody. Oh. Yeah. Like, 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 it's mm. not like you go to the... Like, you can have in your mind that you're going to go to the club and find somebody to have sex with, but you don't know who you're having yeah. sex yeah. with. And that's what makes it a one-night stand. Like, it'd be different if you were going to the club with a group of your friends, and you know that one friend, and you're like, oh, yeah, I'm on a heart tonight. Like, that's, that's not... So then what is that called? Can we find a new word for, like, the... Word sex. A I'm buddy. Sex her tonight. A buddy F. I'm gonna sex her tonight. I'm gonna freak her tonight. 
Can we say freak? Can we say freak? I like freak. I I help help my a buddy freak. I freak I'm a freak her tonight. Okay, and then, a, then sex on a first date can be you know the person prior to go on a date, and then after the date, you have a nightcap. I think that's a little bit more doable because in this, at least, I think that's a signal, like, that signifies you had a good time. Exactly. And also, some people really do like to get it out of the way because for some people, sex is, a bad place. sex is like. Exactly. Oh and nobody God. wants to, because you imagine, and I'm not saying you this is me. You a feet licker and you don't like your feet being But not even just that, but imagine going on like, like for people who have the mentality of I'm going to have sex on a first date and get it over with. Imagine being, going on 10 dates with this person and then that 10th date you have sex with him and this 10th date has been on a, within a span of like three months, right? And you've been only dealing with him. You have sex with him, his penis is little, he has no motion in the ocean and he's, and he talks during sex and you don't like that. You've wasted three months of your time. Talks with like what during sex? <laughs> don't people like it? Like that, he talks like that. I think you I like talk. it, you <laughs> like it, don't you? Say you love it. I'm gonna give you what you want. In his penis, he read the narration. He's like, you... I'm going in now. <laughs> I will now enter your room. I have now reached climax. You My face? God, you look amazing. Are you feeling it yet? <laughs> For me, oh head. my gosh, why are you crying? Are you okay? Are you okay? Oh, are you? I have climaxed. You know the level of like respect that you're, you know the level of like respect you're gonna get, not respect, like the low, the lack of respect you get from a one night stand. But you know what you're going into. Sex on the first date is different. Like if you know you're going into, you both just want to have sex for one time, great. Okay. Sex on the first date, you never know because the other person might just be wanting one night stand with you, and you might have just put out for one person, thinking that it was going to get further. A okay. one night stand, yeah. most people know it's going to be a one night stand. Okay, but then That's what happens if that one night stand turns into you being in a doctor's office saying that you have chlamydia? Why is that the chlamydia? Oh, okay. Why do y'all live? Everything is chlamydia. No, oh, I have chlamydia. Everything ends with what if you? What is your life like? I so never think about. I've never had chlamydia before. I mean, there are just like random. People walking around with super gonorrhea, so like yeah, you don't know. No, listen, that's, you don't know. That's, oh, when I did the safe for sex workshop, they taught me I could find that. Well, we should definitely so I'm good. link them. What we'll if you smell it? Then it's the yeah. check the palms. <laughs> check the palms for syphilis. Okay, and so then listen, but one night stands have these fun phrases like what? Ejaculate, evacuate, <laughs> smash and pass, come and go. <laughs> pregnant, I'm leaving. <laughs> okay, Eli, defend your choice as for why a uh, first date would be your... Oh, would you... I live alone, and when I first started to live alone, I thought it'd be dope. Like, I'm going to have women in here all the time, and then I had stuff in my house, and I was like, what if they wake up and take my stuff? And I've been clinging to that thought ever since. That is... <laughs> I don't want to get robbed. I don't know you people like that. Also... I just like to sleep alone, and then there's always that awkward conversation of, oh, you're still here. Oh. Yeah, but no. But that can also happen within a first, sex on a first date, can it not? No, because with the first date, like, I feel like we know each other's quirks. Like, there's there's more of a background. I think that background that Trey talks about in the club, we have that in a more concise setting. Like, we were talking in a normal, yeah, yeah, so it's just like, I, know you I can probably know. say some weird stuff and it's like, oh, that's his sense of humor. Uh opposed to like we're in the club and I'll be like, hey, you trying to freak a demon? <laughs> and then it's just like, oh, I don't have that rapport with you. But then like, yeah, also my stuff, like I had a flat screen. Also, you hear stories about dudes just taking guys, I mean chicks taking guys home to like send guys their address and your house is getting broken into. I'm good, man. That just sounds like a lot I want to deal with. I like my stuff. Oh, you guys don't think about that. But y'all focus on diseases. You know what's the best? You know what's the worst? Well, also, you can buy oh, back stuff. I'm gonna buy a body. Pause, pause, pause. pause. But also, we don't own a home. Like, oh, I don't own that house, home. so I'm not. Wait, I got one question. So, like, you're home. having a one night stand, and you finish, and it's like 4 a.m., you still gonna kick her out, dude? Or can she stay? Because you said that. Until like 7 o'clock in the morning and then she can leave. Is the Uber more at that time? Or is it just like a you don't got it? Or like, what's the deal? With it? <laughs> Do you know every day you impress me with the things you say? And today no, you really super. I thought I had like a one night stand once. I think it was, and she was sleeping. And I think just. When you I at your house? Yeah, and I didn't think. 
No, because it was like a lead up to it. It was like she's coming over, and I think I turned over and did like this, and I was just was like, oh, because my eyes are closed, and I'm not used to someone being in the bed. And she started swinging and kicking back. Ooh. And I was just like, oh, she needs to go. And she just hit me. She went like a quick four piece, like a, like a quick shuffle kick. And I was like, I don't like this. And she was a little bony bra, so she had the bones all out. And I was like, you could just leave. But she didn't leave till the morning. No, she was like five in the morning. I would rather not wake up to you. There's morning rituals I like to do that include the bathroom. But a first date can go the exact same way. Sex on a first date can go the exact same way. Especially if, like, I, I wish you would rob me and we've been talking all this time. <laughs> Girl, wait, no, no, no. Wait, I know wait, you wait, be at now. I know wait, wait, where you stay. I know no, where your no, grandmama no. stay. I know where your mama no, stay. No. I'm gonna no. find you. But, it was a long but time. But Elijah, there was no specification of how long you've been talking to this person. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, if I'm going on a first date, I wait two to three weeks. I like to generally know someone before I go on a date. I'm a romantic. I don't think you guys noticed that. People, well, no, not at all. By the yeah. days they come out your mouth. No. Yeah, but <laughs> no, rem remember, this is the romantic type. <laughs> is it cheaper to take an Uber at four? <laughs> Why don't you have a car? I mean, I you just, got a just car. met well, up with her randomly. Guys, you guys, drove with yeah, her in you, your car to your place. Yeah, y'all. What if she's you driving in my car? My car ain't even all that good. I just got the. the so you gonna meet somebody at some random place and then make her go in her car? You I go in your car and she wow. follows you. So, <laughs> so it's my fault if I don't want to drive for once. What? What if she didn't come what to the club? What? what if she didn't come to the club in a car in the first place? Oh, oh they're irresponsible. Yes. What also, if she? What? what some if her, people come with friends. Pause. What if her intentions? None of got what if okay, her intentions? Her friend can what, take me if, to her. <laughs> what if her intentions were to go to the club and get drunk and have a good time? She's she's what, being responsible. all those things. She's yeah. being responsible by not driving her own car. And you trust me to drive? I'm the guy who took a shot in the bathroom, and you want me to a drive? Shot? Why did you take a shot in the bathroom? I just have this I image in drink. my head, like you're in a club and you just meet somebody. It's like, okay, you guys agreed, and you're like, okay. So how are you gonna get to my place? <laughs> so um, so how we meet up? <laughs> I thought I was even with you. Nah, so oh, here's the address. Here's the address. Here's my address. Actually, I'll see you in five minutes. No, <laughs> what? I'll take that all back. I don't want to give you my address. I will take you there, and I don't even park on my street. So yeah, we're good. <laughs> I'm gonna ask these questions because I can't actually speak on them because I've never done either. So, so have you guys? Holy. Have I you guys am ever? Open. What? <laughs> have you guys ever had a one night stand? Well, it wasn't during the night. That. D <laughs> Trey, have you ever had a one night stand? <laughs> have you ever had a one day stand? So yes. one time of day. Like a not stand yeah. situation. Yes. How was it? Obviously not good enough for you to do it again. Yeah. I mean, so was I it mean, it will. It would be if I got more prepared. But I it's okay, I'll it. Was spur of the moment? Mm hmm It's so supposed to be. Was it with someone that you knew? Like, ish? Ish. Okay. That's what I'm saying. It's always an ish. I don't think, I'm not really... But that's own. a one-night stand, though, technically. Like, have you ever talked to them again? No. Okay, so it's a one-night stand. I said no. So it was bad. Yeah, it was bad. Like a but I think that was, a, that was just chance. That was gonna be bad. Yeah, because you never know what it was. One night stand is like a Russian roulette with. Oh yeah, you're lovely. just trying to get lucky. But sex on the first date is too. But you can kind of be nicer about it. Nah. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's. You did it once and just never again, or you don't know the person at all. Cause like that whole bang and randoms thing, I'm not really for that. I mean, I guess we can classify it as you had sex with them and never talked to them again. No, I'm good friends with all my sex partners. See, yeah, so no. Yeah, you never oh, had no. a one-night stand. See, like, okay, I've never had a one-night stand, but my opinion on them go very far because there's uh, you know, some friends and their stories, and I'm not really... And my friends and their stories and their friends' stories. Like, I'm not too fond of, you know, people hooking up, like, finding random people at parties and ending up in someone's frat dorm room and then walking that's not always the case though that's like no i know so but those are the stories that i've heard of one night stands and like that's why i'm like Ooh, no not me and also i'm in a relationship but even before i was in a relationship like i just never found it cool to just randomly hook up i don't think i think we're, yeah, we're disparaging I think we're like taking away from the fact that you're vibing with this isn't like hey no you're not vibing with that. that person <laughs> okay so we went out and we got some interviews about different um, topics we wanted to see exactly what some of our Kane students thought about 
one night stands versus sex on a first date. What do you perceive to be better? And what do you think society thinks is better? So let's take a look. So how do you feel about one night stands? They're okay. They're have, you ever, have you ever had a one night stand? Yes. Um, how do you feel about sex on the first date? Perfectly acceptable. What do you think is more acceptable, a one night stand or sex on the first date? I mean, both are situational. So either is acceptable, but I guess sex on the first date, because at least you could continue it. Um, and what circumstance do you feel as though you would have to be in to have a one night stand? Like, what has to happen? Like, anything. Anything? Like, <laughs> right now, what's up? Anybody? No, <laughs> <laughs> no, you know why that's no but it's situation. You, know like, you could be on vacation. What if you don't you like it? Drinks, what, what if you don't like it? And you already went on a date with this person, and then she probably wants to go again. Like, on a date. <laughs> if you guys Women turn men down all the stand, time, right? They say, now we can be friends. Why can't I do the same? Oh, yeah. um, what Didn't circumstance, either. what circumstance um, would you ever be in to have a one night stand? Like, what, what would have to happen for you to have a one night stand? That I won't, I don't know. Just haven't crossed that level yet in my life. Especially, mm -hmm. okay, thank you very much. So I can't. That explains. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you can't really ask okay. me something so you're like this. valuing. I feel like one night stands, if that's how you like to roll, mm -hmm. it's completely fine. Just do it. Exactly. I think, okay, I haven't had a one night stand, but I think for people that do it, it's awesome. I mean, you don't have to go in a relationship. You don't have to like waste time. Most of the time, most of the people that you date, aren't like don't wind up being like the person anyway so like I just yeah I, like, no i agree but, with that but and one if night you need that, that you need that need met you said something it, before like um like what's more what's acceptable? more acceptable yeah one night stands or a sex on the first date i one would night say stand. one night stand <laughs> even though one night stand you're just meeting that person you have sex with them and you never see them again versus you go on the first date have sex and then you can continue going on dates with them that is true. That's true. Like I'm not against like sex on the first date. However, I feel like if you like some people that do have sex on the first date, like m might as well would have just had a one night stand because I feel like there if they were quick to like to do it, then mm -hmm. it was just maybe they just liked each other, so might as well just get it over. With. <laughs> so how do you feel about one night stands? They're okay, I guess. I, I don't think it's really my thing. How do you feel about sex on the first date? I feel like that's rushing it. Yeah. Honestly. Because, like, I don't know. I don't know how people think sometimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, like that. I don't know how it's like. <laughs> what do you think is more acceptable, sex on the first date or uh, one night stand? One night stands are more acceptable because, like, Sex on the first date, people like kind of look down on it. I, a, a lot of people I know look down on sex on the first date because like that's that's a rushing it. And B, it's like you might yeah you might as well just have one night stand. If you don't like it, if you find that you're not really sexually compatible with that other person, mm -hmm. why would you continue seeing them? Yeah, because I know sex is in everything in a relationship. But it's also kind of a big part. Yeah, I feel you. Thank you. How do you ladies feel about one night stands? Yeah. Um, I don't um, like them. Yeah. Like, yeah. I don't like them because I'm very like, oh my god, what if he has this and this and this and I don't know that. But I feel like they happen. I saw you. I'm gonna make sure that I'm gonna ask about this. I feel like they happen, but I feel like you should. Yeah, you're good. Like just like when you're in a relationship with whoever, you should be safe. Yeah. In both yeah. instances. Like, I feel like so long as you tell them, like, look, like, I'm done to do this, but I also need to know X, Y, and Z. I feel like if you're okay to do this, they at least owe you at least mm -hmm. that little snippet of information. Yeah. yeah. Um, how do you ladies feel about sex on the first date? I feel like it happens as well. Yeah, it's the same thing. Um, yeah. I don't yeah. think it's any different, honestly. And it's like, but it's just like a stigma against like women who have, like, you know, but it's okay for guys to do it, but I mean, I don't know. Like, for me personally, I don't want it to interfere with someone thinking I'm easy. Mm. Because, like, yeah, some guys would be like, oh, no, it's not. Like, we don't think you're easy. But, like, I feel like um, the majority of them would be like, yeah, she's, like, I already got it. Yeah, it puts so out on the first wanna, date. Yeah. Like, yeah. So yeah. I kind of want to make them work for it. What do you think is more acceptable, a one-night stand or sex on the first date? 
Because there is a difference between the two. There is. I feel like. I think of one um, night stand. Yeah. One night stand. Because that can happen like. Really? Yeah. Because a lot of people, well, a lot of people are saying one night stands, but I would assume a first date because at least with a first date, you kind of go into knowing who that person is already. Where a one night stand is like, it could be some random person you have sex with one time and then that's it. But I, I think that's the like yeah, okay that's, about it like that's like it. it's like, like a one, one time and, and yeah like a one and done like yeah. you don't ever have to see this person again but with like mm. a first day it's like you want to build something yeah. yeah and like you don't want that person to have a certain mentality about you but the one I stand you can care less what you think yeah um and what circumstance would you personally have to be in to have a one night stand like what what would the factors have to be for you to be like okay I'm just gonna have sex with this random person. Um, I don't know. It doesn't have to be anything. It's just like if I want to do it or not. <laughs> it just have to be like, okay, I want to do this. Yeah. Like, it'll yeah. be my choice. Yeah, because like some people are like, I have to be drunk. I oh, be, no. I don't, no, I don't have to be drunk. I mean, I probably would be because like I said, I don't do that. Yeah. I, it's not that I don't do it, but like it's like, um. I'm not gonna it's be like, oh, let me have a one night stand yeah. today. It's like yeah. something that kind of like. It's not something. That's not something that happens yeah, just for fun. The yeah, the environment yeah. would have like I would say my, for me the environment would probably be like I'm at like a party or like I'm at like an event or something and mm-hmm. I like meet somebody we vibe and I'm like okay well. It's I think that's really all, it, would, it would all <laughs> come down to, to like if I wanted to, yeah. if I want to do that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. Thank you. A lot of people said that one night stands are more acceptable than. Uh, sex on a first date. Why? Why? Thank you, my loyal audience. I don't understand why. Like, it, it doesn't make much sense to me because me personally, well, even though I've never had sex on the first date, like, I, at, like, during that date, depending, like, let's just, let's say, for instance, we've been talking for a month and we decide to go on a date finally. Like, it's now in our schedule to go on a date. Now on this date, I'm getting to know you even more in person. You know what I mean? And then if I feel like, okay, from the vibe that I got for you for a month, and then the vibe that I'm getting from you off this date, now we can go and have sex. And if I like it, we can continue. If I don't, then we can talk about it and figure out what's best. Cut it out or, you know, simmer things down. Talk to other people. And I think that's a lot more acceptable. That would hurt my feelings. Why would that hurt your feelings? Listen, that I hurt. thought you were amazing as a person. <laughs> I really thought this could be a thing. Checked all my boxes. But yeah. as soon as you I did it out, thought that wasn't a factor. Finding out is a huge factor. Right. Let's think <laughs> so about like, like for this. me, I like when I stand. I w- I've never had a one night stand, but I've had sex on the first day before, and I can get with a one night stand more because, like, after. A lot of the times after I had sex on the first date, the guy either just completely ghosted or like I've had a few of them like and we were talking for like not short amount of times at all. And then I've even had a few of them just tell me like, honestly, like you're really dope, but this was just sex for me. I think sometimes as men we're t- thought like women, we've definitely been taught that like women don't have the same sexual desires we want. So a lot of guys tend to lie and be like, oh, I want something. Yeah. yeah. I come up front. Man, what do you want? Sex. I don't want that. Okay, so, I completely understand. So it's more acceptable to just be straight up on... No, we're not doing this. Please. Move the freak over. I already told you guys I'm hot. Y'all just compress my... Because I'm just on the side. Why are we like this? You just compress compress my arms to my oh. armpits and now I'm sweating. Move over. Move over. Be like you could move a little. Please. Thank Stop. you. I can't move there you I'm gonna move over this way so you have some more space. We kind of like a Christmas thing going on. Yeah, I like it. Okay, okay. <laughs> um, but like, I don't know. Like, I just, I me mean, personally, I can never morally have sex on, like, I can never morally have a one night stand just because I'm not having sex with a rando. I'm sorry, I'm not. I don't know you. I don't know what you're about. You could be a serial killer, and while you climax, you could stab me in the heart. That's the what? Uh, That's okay. Okay. Right. Uh, anyway, I will say okay. it's okay. We're gonna bleep it. It's Another thing bleep. to the whole oh first God, date thing. I think uh, it just, at least you know what this person wants. Like I don't know if you like to be choked when I meet you on that first oh. or at the club. Why is that something you're it's thinking your about? To go. I feel like a one night stand needs to be Quick sex. Question. That's uh, it. Wait, wait. Do yeah, one night joke? stands can't have kinks involved. Yes, but I like to be choked by my boyfriend. I like to be choked by my boyfriend, not a stranger. Like Who wants to be choked by a stranger? You like to be choked? 
No. Okay, Who wants to be choked by a stranger? Me. I meet you, and you're like, I'm thinking I'm gonna die. I'm dead now. I'm but dead. That's your king. That's what I'm saying. That conversation you have. I you don't have that I don't think you have you... enough time in a one night stand to bring up kids. Exactly. You just I'm not sex. advocating for that. I, sex, man. No, I said when you do the first date thing, you have the opportunity to figure out what someone likes, their kinks and whatnot. It's different when the one night stand, you're just having standard sex, which may not be all that great, opposed to we've been talking about this for a little bit. You seem like the type who would like this. And also, it's not weird if I bring it up because like we've been talking, so let's just have this quick little kick conversation in the car ride. As right before we do this, but Wait, I'm what not. What's your position on this? I completely. He but, did first night, first, first, first. I like being choked. Sex on the first date. Oh, sex, sex on the first date was his yeah, yeah, position. Okay. And he's talking about one night stands. And no, I said sex on the first stands. date okay. I'm the one seems stands. better because you get to build that rapport. Oh, yes. But my thing I is, I feel is that, like we went all out for me to repeat that three times. Yes, I know, but now you're saying that on a, if you are having a one night stand and you get with a girl, you get in a car and on the way to your house, you're going to talk about your kink. So then no, at that point, I'm you would choke her. you do that with the first date because you have that rapport. Also, you can take that from the text message. If we've been talking, that has to be some type of flirting. It's like, oh, I'll show you. Oh, I might right. like that. Just, what, what do you guys think? Shit. What do you guys think the pros What's and cons of a one night stand is? Let's do the pros. You could get robbed. Okay. Let's do the pros no, first. The Let's do the pros <laughs> first. Surprised good sex. Like, if you didn't expect okay, to. Okay, but man. how is that a pro if you don't know if it's going to be good? <laughs> well, the pros is it took me. Yo, you on the. That's a. That was a pro. Let him have that one, please. Also, remember that I've never had one. No, but I'm saying, like, it's a a surprise. Because then, like, you gotta think if it sucks, it's like, uh huh. But if it was like, whoa, whoa, it's like, whoa. Like a roller coaster. Yeah. Like the emoji we sent in the group chat today. And if. And if you guys really vibe, you guys can get really good candy store sandwiches the day after. No, you can't, because it's a one night stand. You're never talking to them again. No, I never talked to you after we get the sandwiches. Pros and cons of of one night stands. They might give me another pro. That's not a one night <laughs> stand, bro. But if you never, if you never see them after, it's not yeah. just a sex. It's you that night. It's a one night, night, stand. night. Would you continue contact if they were the like most bomb? Sex you've ever had. Even if you came into it, like, yeah. like this is a one Like you had a whole contract with it, like this is the one time, but it was the best thing you ever had. Would you find yeah, it? Yeah, of course. I ain't got nothing to lose. I don't mean be doing nothing half the time. Okay, what's the sure. cons? Is that still a one night stand? What's the cons then? of a one night stand? Pregnancy. STD. Knew it! You got it! You hear it? Oh, I just knew it. Just had to wing it up. Oh, what? Did you want to hear robbery? <laughs> No, 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 What's the pros of sex on a first date? You know what you're potentially getting into for the second date. If penis wise. If penis or vagina wise. There's build up. Like there's actually huh? like some type of, I know this person, I think they're cool. What's the cons of, of sex on a first date? It could be real bad and you don't want to talk to him again, but you realize, oh, I wait, feel like, my life Yeah, now. I feel like you can be mean you can be mean in a one night stand. You can't be mean hey, with sex on the first date. Listen, <laughs> your your personality, your everything I wanted in life. Yeah, but you got a shrimpy. You oh! But if you go on endless round, you got that endless shrimp. You can just keep plowing it in. I'm plowing um, it in. But what is there it's to just plow like, in? I don't want you that. Were, did you have sex on the first date? <laughs> yes. Did you go on a second date? No, oh, wait. Fine. First date? Mm, no. I don't think I've had any of those things we've talked about today. Sorry, you said that you've been on a, you've been in a date, we've been on, you've had sex on a first date. Yeah. And you didn't go on a second date after. Mm-mm. Not, like, m- like maybe, two times, but all, like, the other all other times. Time. Yeah. Do you believe a one-night stands are safe? No. No. Probably. If you, if you're smart about it, you yes. Fight and she ain't trying if you're, if you you're, gotta, if you're, why do you keep thinking about these girls robbing you, bro? Every girl is not out for your money and your possessions. It's not the money. It's your, the your Xbox. Nobody wants your Xbox. Because I want <laughs> so what, what circumstances do you have to be in to have a one night stand? I gotta be there. It's gotta be there. It's like you. Pause. Pause. Like a, you said you have to be there. Yeah, it can't happen if I'm not there. Duh. Oh. Duh. Oh. Duh. What were the circumstances that led you to be like, yeah? I'm gonna well, there's gotta be that something that's like. I, 
Très bien. Like, ça me je ne sais quoi. Oh. Hey. Je suis oh. parlé un peu pour en français. Oh, uh, I'm just any foreign. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you get them home. Wait, you're just Italian. Say, I don't, don't speak Italian. I don't speak a stitchy, but I speak Spanish, French, and English. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. What circumstances there have to be? I think my circumstance would have to be that that before our first date, I got to know you, so I'm comfortable with you. Anybody agree or disagree? Or are we just gonna keep saying that they have to be there? Because I'm confused. Nah, she's right. I second. I concur. You second that? You third I, that? I concur. Thank you. Yeah, I'm we took it to the Instagram what? page. <laughs> <laughs> we did an Instagram page at Birds and the Bees one. one. That's Birds and the Bees one, and we asked a few questions. So, one. Let's check one. it out. Um, what do you believe is more acceptable, a one night stand or sex on the first date? Forty six percent of our followers said a one night stand, and fifty four percent said sex on the first. Closest date. margin we've had all That's season. That's true. Because they've either yeah. been like left there. A lot of these. Okay, so then the next question was, have you ever had sex on the first date? 55% said yes, and 45% said no. All right, 45% of people are lying. <laughs> if, you, if you have had sex on the first date before, did you guys end up going on a second date? I don't believe this. 71% said yes, and 29% said hell no. <laughs> Um, because you put hell before the no. What circumstances does there have to be for you to have a one night stand? Someone said bad sex. That doesn't shrimp. make any sense to me. <laughs> no, 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 no. Of course it makes sense for you. Like, we just. It says, what circumstance does there have to be for you to have a one night stand? Bad sex. You Explain start off, me. and then she's just start making weird old noises, and you're like, oh, I don't want to do this anymore. Wait, you, circumstances to not. To have. So is that saying you're going to have sex on the first date, but it turns out being a one night stand? No, no, no. It's like a one But that's not a one night stand, before, stand yeah. because if it's a date, then you right. know that person. Or are they saying but that they had bad sex? Who knows? And then they went. Um, what do you consider a one night stand? Having sex with a person you barely know and don't plan on keeping in contact with. What do you consider a one night stand when you have sex that one night, but it's meaningless? Um, Y'all have sex and never talk after that. Um, this is what circumstances does it have to be to have a one night stand? Someone said, I can't do it. I'm too scared of catching something. You got something. Chlamydia. So, so chlamydia. Why is it always chlamydia with y'all two? <laughs> I have a question. So if you have a one night stand and they're like, I don't plan on ha I'm talking to them ever again, but you have another one night stand with that same person because you go to a party or something and they're still there, what happens? That's not a one night stand. That's a two night stand. But does that change the That's last one? No, no, no. We're bang buddies now. We just, if we meet up at a party. That's not a bang buddy though because that, like, it's not something that you guys plan every time you go to a party. Like, oh, yeah, you just got, have sex you just had sex multiple it's times with that person. Yeah, you did. Just be we make an up. agreement. I pull out the contract, my notary form. <laughs> Notary. Got notarized at the bank. Someone said, someone said um, to what circumstance, they said, when I've officially lost my mind, lol, not judging people who do, though, different strokes for different people. Every, the people who different say different that they're not judging, they be the worst. How yeah. yeah. so, so, so for you to have sex on the first date, what would that, what would that other person have to do? The, give off a good vibe, make you feel safe, not pressured, comfortable. Another one was really wow me. I would also have to know them and be comfortable with them. In your house? But you know, most people, most people ended up saying the same thing. I, but still, I was very surprised that people picked a one night, one night stand over sex on a first date. Like that's just mind boggling. Yeah, we're living in a society of people don't want to have feelings. Sometimes you just want. Uh, yeah, a lot of people just don't. I have had a date. We are wrapping it up. I am glad that we had this conversation about one night stands. Listen, if you're gonna have a one night stand, be. Just go do it. Just don't look me in my eyes, people. Go do it. Don't let no one, don't let nothing stop you. Be the master of your face. Women, be the feminist you want to be. Men, if she says no, that is a no. But women, take charge. Grab his nipples. Tell him what he wants to hear. Men, play along. Give a ride home unless the Uber is too much. Get it cracking. Thank you guys for watching the show and learning a little bit more about us. Not only what we prefer, but what you guys prefer because you guys participated in our polls. You know, one night stands versus sex on the first date. Next week we'll be talking about casual sex versus relationship sex and what you think is personally better. My name is Ashley Neal. I'm Trey Perello. I'm Elijah Colossus. Thank you for watching. Let's talk about sex, baby. Let's go.